running for mayor. And uh, right now, there's a lot of momentum that's happening right now. We see the Bronx Joker. I've never seen this before. As a New Yorker, I've never seen so many people together in one party as the Republican Party. So we have a great momentum going. And Nicole is one that's going to be the first woman mayor in New York City. That's the hopes that we have. And that's going to be on November 7th. So we're going to see if we can get some words in with her so in regards to the Latino community, because I know she's worked very beautifully with the Latino community. She's been to two with me. I've actually interviewed her with two Dominican Day parades. She's been in so many cultures. I was with her also with the Pakistanian parade, and she was awesome. She was well received. And this is the momentum that we need here in the city, okay? So we're going to see if we can get a word in in a bit. Nicole, how are you? Good. And Rick and Joe, we meet again. I was just telling everybody the Latino community, what message can you give a los Latinos de República de aquí, República Dominicana, Puerto Rico, to come out to vote for uh, Republicans? Well, first let me say that uh, my heart, my prayers are with the people of Puerto Rico right now. I have family also that resides in uh, San Juan. We were able to find out that they're okay yesterday, so I'm very grateful for that. Uh, but my, my prayers are with those who still don't know if their family is okay. And they're, uh, I know how um, upsetting it is because in the last three days, my mother and I have been trying to get in touch with the family. Um, so first let me say that we need to do a lot to help Puerto Rico right now because not only have they been So uh, when you have a mayor that has no results, 
um, has little to point to in terms of, of success or making life better for people in New York City. Um, you know, the, the people are going to be as excited to come out and pull the lever for you. you got to remember, he spent millions of dollars to try to pull out the vote, and only 11% of registered Democrats came and pulled the lever for him. And that tells me that we have a lot of opportunity. That what I see in the street is is is, is true, then, if, that, if that's the case. And that, and that means that people are just disenchanted. They want it. Somebody's going to be serious about the issues that are plaguing our city. We don't need a mayor who's fighting a national ideological war. We need a mayor who's going to actually manage the city and do the job they were elected to do. Oh, thank you so much. I wish you luck. All right. Thank you. That was Nicole Shavor Mayor. She's going to be winning the first women uh, mayor in the city. The Latinos, we really want folks to see this. A los Latinos que sepan en español, aquí tenemos una persona que.